You guys, it's baby day on the farm. Um, it's very windy. It's kind of cold. It is supposed to be in like the 50s today, but it's gonna drop tonight to like 25 and then it's in the 30s the next two days. Stupid. Um, so we're gonna need to get her inside. Like we were hoping she could just cab out there and everything would be great, but I don't, I don't like that with a newborn. Um, bee farmers are probably laughing at me, okay? It's whatever. Uh, so anyways, we're gonna have to rig up a little pen Probably in the calf barn, that's the only, I don't even know why we call it the calf barn. We don't really have calves in there, where our frats are. Um, there's some space in the back. We've had cows there before. So I'm going to start to rig up something while she she's in labor. She's not really pushing yet, but um, if she gets up, I might try to move her before. Just because then I don't have to carry the baby. And Brunson's babies are very heavy. <laughs> Joey's at work, of course. Um, so I'm going to see what I can do as far as rigging up a pen for her. And then, yeah, we're gonna have a baby soon. I'm so excited. Are you guys excited? Yay. Okay, so essentially this will be a good little area, but we need to close that off because we still have, um, we got a pile of finisher over there. And then, oh my gosh, you guys didn't even know what happened with our grower the other day. I'll uh, have to put a little video. I, I took a video for Instagram, it was not good. But yeah, we've got this left over. This is dry. We still have <laughs> still have a little pile of the wet stuff that we're kind of working through, just mixing it with the dry stuff, feeding some to the pigs. Because we obviously don't want any of it to go to waste. So, all right, this is what I'm working with. I don't think I have a gate like long enough, so I'm gonna have to get a couple gates probably. Cutie, what are you doing? Um, yeah, we'll make it work. It'll be fine. What are you doing? I never know what you're doing. Still pregnant. The other one's still pregnant. She's getting a nice little butter on her, though. Aren't you? Yes. She wanted to plow this over, probably could, but she's gonna be a new mother, you guys. Um, this is actually gonna be really inconvenient because we feed these two pens hay inside and the hay's over here, but it is what it is. Joey might have a better idea when <laughs> he gets home. We can always move a bale over here, I guess. So, these are all, <laughs> ta-da! <laughs> these are all old eggs. I don't even know when they're from. So they're gonna go to the pigs. Um, the chickens were like just they lay them in between everything what do you think grace do you like eggs would you like an egg remember there was a challenge where they like had the dogs eat an egg and they were really gentle with it grace apparently doesn't want to join the challenge and i just stepped on an egg Ew, another one they're everywhere oh they are everywhere Bunch of broken ones back here. Sorry, we don't have chicks somewhere. All right, should we go check on our girl? Why'd you put your butt that way? I can't see you. Baby will care, and I care. Okay. You gonna help me? 
Pull me up here, Kitty. Are you gonna help me? This is probably not gonna go well. Get your best friend. Date set up. No, I, the hard part is gonna be getting her through this pen. They're still kind of loud. They were weaned last week. They're getting better, but they're probably gonna wanna try to escape. So, wish me luck. At least if they do escape, they can't get out anywhere else. So, we've got that going for us. You're all gonna be very well behaved though, aren't you? Yes, mother. Mama. Good girl. Check out this calving suite I got for you. Best birthing suite on the market. I don't, you're not the father. I'm sorry. Best part about this pen, I didn't have to bet it because we've had Betty in store deer, so it's already bedded. And then when she gets done and wants a snack, boom, I got you. Hey, already, girl. I'll just have to bring in some water, but she ain't interested in drinking at this point, so. you get settled honey that's not no you don't joy that's not a scratching post it's just you having a baby not eating things. I'm trying to keep myself busy. I just gave some of the pigs some of that wet grain. They love it. Also, why are they so big already? They're like almost to the point where they're not cute anymore. <laughs> yeah, I'm joking. You're still cute. Don't look at me like that. We literally just cleaned this out or Joey cleaned it out a day or two ago. We had two inches of rain. A lot of rain. It was probably more than two inches when it was all said and done, so that flooded. Um, so yeah, this side is pretty nice and dry at least, but we have these six, then we have Peter and Petunia, who also broke out so they can go in with the cows now, but they're too fat to get out, so it's okay. And then we have four left from our previous group. Um, five of them went in to the locker plant, and I think it's... I think two of them we decided we we're going to keep and breed and then um, our runt and we had just one small one so let him catch up and take care of him <laughs> it amazes me what those cats like this to do like she'll just drag them around play with them i thought that maybe grace needs another doggy friend but she plays with the cats and the goats so well so it's like 
I don't know. Do I need another dog? Probably not. What do you think you're doing? Alright, I'm done with chores, so I'm gonna go be a helicopter mom again and watch her for a little bit. And we will check in soon. Who's having a baby? Okay. Joy's gonna have her baby. Today? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Cutie's like, I'm staying out of this. <laughs> Lisa's least trying to be good moral support for everyone. These guys are just trying to eat me, but they need to. Baby. We don't want her to be stressed out. <laughs> she just popped the feet out so I can make sure he's coming in the right direction. Then that be her baby, but the problem with Swiss, especially his first calf heifers, is Swiss calves are usually pretty big, especially if they're bulls. I don't know if it's bull or heifer, um, but those feet are just ginormous. Sometimes it's hard to get the head out. So I don't want to like leave her. Um, she's not like in distress or anything, so we're just kind of we're just kind of hanging out. She's pushing a lot more though, so horrible things are moving along. Playing tug of war.
All the emotions. I might cry. I don't know the last time I cried when I, when I had a baby. I am so I, Oh my god, I'm so happy. Okay. I need to compose myself. Oh my god. You did that, Joy. Yeah, that's your baby. Oh. I'm, I'm so happy. One, Sophia now has a calf to show this year um, because with the way prices were, we just weren't gonna be able to afford a spring calf for her. So I'm so, so thankful that we now have one. Um, I'm thankful that I got that sucker out. That was a, a little hole in a big head and it was, it was a hard pull, but um, I'm definitely going to invest in some polling chains because um, come August we're going to have a lot more cows being born um, and a lot of them are going to start coming out of heifers. So, uh, I'm, I'm on cloud nine, you guys. So exciting. Okay, I am going to put my jacks back on because it's freaking cold and then go grab her some warm water and I'm gonna go find the boys and have them go get Sophia out of the house because she is gonna be, she's gonna be so excited. She's probably gonna be as happy as I am. My, here, it hurts from smiling. I'm so excited. Okay, sorry Jody, I got your hat pulled after birth. It wasn't like the dog. <laughs> You are a good mama, Joy. About probably 10 minutes old. It's already trying to start to get up. Yeah, those long legs she's got, huh? It's okay. Probably not the best place for your water, was it? <clears throat> At least I didn't feel very full. I put some warm water in here for her. Just to get her drinking. 
Oh my god, I almost just smoked my head up. <laughs> Gracie, you're not wanted in here. Go away. Nope. Out. Go out. That doesn't mean come by me. Mommy doesn't like you. No. Make her nervous. I guess I should probably let Cutie get out of here. The flower. Here, why don't you... Do you want to stay in here? Because if I shut that door again, you're going to be stuck. Okay. Okay, fine, but don't say I didn't warn you. Good job, Mama. What a day. What a good day. Um, I am going to let these two handle their business for a while. I'll come back and check on them in a little bit. Um, essentially, now we're just going to want to make sure that baby gets claustrum. And I am not going to bottle feed her. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to resist the urge to milk, try my hand and bottle feed her. I don't know, let nature do its thing. Because beef cows do it all the time. Okay, okay. Um, so yeah, we'll just let them hang out, come back, check on her, make sure that she did get claustrum. Um, I'm she doesn't better. But yeah, I guess next step we're gonna have to get a new I'm gonna go get Sophia so she can come down and see her too, but uh so good so good all right thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed the video i hope it wasn't like graphic or anything i hope that youtube doesn't like kick me off so um if you did like it let me know uh leave us a comment a like subscribe all the things uh we really appreciate you guys watching this so we will see you next time and i guess if you do have any good j girl names put them in the comments because um the way that we name our calves is like whatever their mom's name was. We use the same letter. So, hi Dumbo. Since her name is Joy, we're gonna go ahead and do a J girl name. Don't bite me. All right, can you say bye? Bye. bye.